What is up, you guys? This is Mini Superheroes Today. And in today's video, we are winding the clocks back to 2014 to take a look at this Lego set, 76011 Batman Man Bat Attack. This set was for ages 6 to 12 years old, retailed for $19.99, had three minifigures and 184 pieces. And one other thing that I want to point out about this set is I am 100% convinced that if you are a LEGO Super Heroes fan and buying LEGO sets in the year 2014, you had this set. Because every time I buy a LEGO collection that has sets from this era, I get this set in it. So. I have probably owned like nine copies of this set over the years, but in any case, uh, let's start taking a look at this set. Now, the Batman is not anything miraculous, nothing that we haven't seen elsewhere before, right? It's just this standard black cowed Batman, same head, turned around, exactly the same. Uh, you know, it's just the same Batman figure we've seen a hundred times. There's not much to say about it. Do love that papery cape, though. Up next, we have Man Bat, who was exclusive to this set for a very long time, but he's been popping up in different variations a little more as of late, but he's got standard blue legs. He's got these bat arms, which are very cool with the wings. He's kind of got some fur printing on his chest there. He's got an open mouth on this side with a bat uh, headpiece there, and when you flip that around, you can see he's a little more scared on this side. He also comes with two sticks of dynamite which go in his hands, which uh, is interesting, I guess, but I always thought it was kind of weird, you know, like, what happens if he drops the dynamite, or what happens if he doesn't drop it fast enough, I don't know, just kind of a strange thing. Anyways, here we've got Nightwing, and this red and black Nightwing has been exclusive to the set, and as of this video, continues to be. Uh, you can see he's kind of got this little paraglider wing thing here, which is, I mean, it's whatever. It's a cool little build, but it's obviously just there to up the piece count. And then the figure himself, he does have two sides to his head. And man, is he dusty, I'm seeing there. But that's what you get when you buy used sets. Anyways, got some black spiky hair, a smile on this side, and kind of more of like a scowl on this side. But a really great figure, one that's still pretty desirable. And as of these days, it's probably the main draw for this set is to get that Nightwing. I'll tell you what the main draw of this set isn't yet another bat vehicle but it is a nice bat helicopter like if you don't have one or anything like it i mean i'm not gonna say it's a terrible vehicle but i'm just much more of a playset kind of guy so the vehicle is just you know i don't know how many vehicles batman really needs but anyways there's a spinning propeller on the back the wheels on the bottom actually all spin kind of a cool thing we have some poseable flick fire missiles on either side here of course the top propeller moves we do have these little turbines that move, although I'm not sure if they really need to. We have a winch, which is really cool. So you can see that winch. And when you turn this knob, it actually will pull that winch back up, as you can see. Won't waste your time and do that. But we can open up the front cockpit and you can fit exactly one minifigure inside. Now it's kind of hard to do with uh, one hand here, but you can see that that would close up and put Batman in there if I could do it with more than just the one hand. So you guys get the gist. But anyways, drop a comment below and let me know what you think of this set. Actually, more important than that, let me know if you had this set. Let me know if my theory that everybody collecting LEGO superheroes in the year 2014 had this set. Let me know if that theory is correct. So drop a comment below. I will look forward to reading all of those. Be sure to hit like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the next video. If you liked what you saw and you liked what you heard, feel free to click that subscribe button for more LEGO content coming in the near future. So, thanks for tuning in to today's video, and until next time, build on.